This is now running a 100 volt battery pack, 24S LiPo. And I have the base current set to 225 amps and I'm allowing up to 150 battery amps to be drawn from it. All right, what I have here is the temperature sensor, which is going to a thermal couple to the inside of the controller. I have that onto a, the actual case of the MOSFET. As you can see right now, the maximum temperature is 26.2 on the MOSFET. And I will be logging to see how high it goes during testing. show the uh, startup torque, I'm going to throttle it while I'm on the brake, on the front brake here. As you can see, it has pretty good startup torque. Of course, starting from a low speed will cause it to fault if you give it enough. There we go, got it to fault. So, at very low speed, you can still cause it to fault by overriding it with the brakes. Then to get it to go again, all you got to do is pedal over the set RPM and it re-engages. And if you look here, as I've been data logging, my maximum MOSFET temp was 52 Celsius during uh, several back-to-back -back pulls. After a few back-to-back -back passes, which are probably over 50 miles an hour, the temperature is only got up to 60 Celsius.